Hi, and welcome back to the BSG Primer Series. This short primer is about how to submit a contribution to a study group meeting. The first thing you need to know are the key deadlines. The contribution needs to be submitted at least 12 calendar days before the study group meeting in question. And if the contribution requires translation, the deadline is two months before the study group meeting. So what does a contribution look like? Well, basically, it's a Word document in the correct study group template, which should contain three key elements. The first is an abstract, a summary of the contribution. The second is a discussion or rationale. And the third most important part is the proposal. Effective contributions always contain a clear proposal that can help move the work of the study group forward. There are two ways to submit your contribution to the study group. The first is online through a system called DDP or direct document posting. And the second is via email to the study group secretariat. Let's take each one of these in turn. How do you submit via DDP? Well, first, visit the website of the study group to which you are submitting the contribution and find the link for direct document posting. Click on the link and there you will see, as it's explained on the website, that DDP is a two-stage process to submit your contribution. First, you need to register the document and second, you need to upload the document. So the first thing you can do is register a document. You click on register a document. There is a form to fill out, so you fill in the information. And then on the bottom right, when you're ready, you click on register. If the document registration is successful, you will receive an acknowledgement email with further instructions, like the number of the document and how to upload. What you want to do as well on the direct document posting website is to extract the template for your study group in order to upload your document. Insert the text of your contribution in the template provided. Once it's ready and you've already registered your document, you can upload it directly. And there you have it. The other way to submit a contribution is via email. Once again, you need to find the template that, you, that is to be used for that study group. And you can find that document template on the main page of the study group. You, you use that template to insert the text of your contribution and when it's ready, you simply send it via email to the study group email address, tsbsg, study group number, at itu.int. So for example, for study group three, the email address is tsbsg3 at itu.int. We're very much looking forward to receiving your contributions. Thanks for joining us. This short video has been brought to you by the ITUT Bridging the Standardization Gap Program.